Hey guys, Alexi here with another book review. Uh, I'm catching up on my book reviews still for the last uh, year and a half or so. I've been reading a lot, but haven't really had a lot of time to do my reviews. So this week, I want to talk about a book by Malcolm Gladwell called The Outliers, a story, uh, the story of success. Now, Malcolm Gladwell uh, was considered one of the top influential people by the Time magazine back in 2005. And this book isn't new, obviously. It took me a while to get to it. And if there's any books, by the way, that you guys would like to recommend, uh, I'd love to have a, uh, a listen or a read through. Just uh, flick it through in the comments and, um, yeah, I'll check them out. Um, now, this book is really uh, a great analysis as to why some people are more successful than others. And Malcolm goes into, uh, you know, ice hockey, for example, to find out why some of the best uh, ice hockey players are born um, in the same sort of months. And it's quite fascinating. It's really got to do with the cycle as to when kids are getting into uh, ice hockey to start with, how young they are and how basically they have the um, time advantage over the others uh, by being on the ice for longer. You know, it sounds pretty straightforward, but that is one of the things, I guess. Uh, in order to be really good at something, you need to spend more time doing it. That is the fact, simple fact that gets uh, some of the people to be the best. Um, you look at someone like Cristiano Ronaldo, for example, he spends enormous amount of time training and uh, kicking the ball overall, and that's what really makes him the best. Um, you know, talent, being the best, having the right support, these sort of things, that's what Malcolm talks about. So definitely check out The Outliers, and I think you'll find quite a few things there, whether into music, sport, uh, business or anything else. I think uh, it's very important to be aware of what makes people successful or unsuccessful and just be realistic about the whole thing because I personally feel really sorry about uh, some parents, um, you know, putting their kids through things they don't particularly enjoy, they're not for them, or potentially just get them to do it for the sake of doing it. And uh, really, you know, if you don't, if you align people with things that they're not very good at or potentially that aren't really uh, aligning with their personality, then you're not going to get very much out of it. So, Really cool book, uh, really, uh, you know, a lot of um, aha moments. And from there, I think a lot of learnings to understand exactly what to do uh, in terms of uh, your own stuff, how to sort of, you know, get into something, how to do it really well. But also, you know, for me as a parent, um, a great book to potentially lead my kids through life and align them with the things that they potentially could be really good at. So, yeah, check it out. Uh, there's definitely quite a few other books that... Um, uh, Malcolm has written uh, one of them I've read recently as well called Talking to Strangers. I'll do another review at, uh, about that another time. But for the time being, um, subscribe to my channel. Make sure that you uh, put comments and likes in here as well. I'd like to find out what you guys are thinking. And if you enjoy this review, share it. Thanks, guys.